हेलो एस्पिरेंट्स एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल वी वी आर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट जोमेट्रिक डिज़ाइन ऑफ हाईवे इंजीनियरिंग अर्लियर वी हैव डिस्कस्ड सम ऑफ द इम्पॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स ऑफ द क्रॉस सेक्शनल पेवमेंट क्रॉस सेक्शनल एलिमेंट्स ऑफ अ पेवमेंट वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट पेवमेंट सफिस करेक्टरिस्टिक नाउ इन दिस वीडियो टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट कैम्बर एंड कर्व सो हेयर इज ए क्विक रिविजन द मेन फीचर्स कंसिडर्ड फॉर जोमेट्रिक डिज़ाइन ऑफ हाईवे आर फर्स्ट वन इज क्रॉस सेक्शनल एलिमेंट्स सेकेंड द ग्रेडियंट थर्ड द इंटरसेक्शन फोर्थ साइड डिस्टेंस इन क्रॉस सेक्शनल एलिमेंट्स वी हैव लर्न अबाउट पेमेंट सर्फिस कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स टूडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट कैम्बर एंड कर्ब द अदर एलिमेंट्स आर रोड मार्जिन्स फॉर्मेशन विथ एंड विथ ऑफ कैरियज वे लेट्स स्टार्ट वॉट इज कैम्बर कैम्बर और कैंट इज द क्रॉस लो प्रोवाइडेड टू रेज मिडल ऑफ रोड सर्फेस in the transverse direction to drain off rain water from the road surface here we can see in diagram the central raised portion of the pavement is called as camber what are the objectives of providing camber the objectives of providing camber are surface protection especially for gravel and bituminous road subgrade protection by proper drainage quick drying of payment which in turn increases safety too steep slope is undesirable as it will erode the surface camber is measured in 1 in n or n percentage that is if camber is provided 1 in 50 then in percentage it will be as 1 by 50 into 100 that is 2% and the value depends upon the type of payment surface the values suggested by irc for various categories of payment is here we can see in the table this is very important table as prov provided by irc for different type of pavement this table consists of three columns first one is type of road surface and second one is a range of camber in areas that is further divided into heavy rainfall area or low rainfall area for cement concrete and thick bituminous surface camber in heavy rainfall area is 2% whereas in low rainfall area This camber is one point seven percent. The camber for thin bituminous surface in heavy rainfall area is two point five percent, and in low rainfall area is two percent. For WBM and gravel pavement, in heavy rainfall area camber is three percent, and in low rainfall area camber is two point five percent. For earthen road, in heavy rainfall area is four percent, and in low rainfall area is three percent. Now. there are different type of camber first one is composite camber second one is barrel camber third one is slope or straight camber fourth one is two straight line camber we will discuss one by one about these composite camber composite camber might be composed of partly parabola and partly straight line or two line or two straight line having different slope here we can see clearly in the para uh, in the diagram parabola portion is provided at the center whereas at edges slope is given by straight line the central part of the road is made parabolic and provided with straight slopes near edges this helps to decrease in intensity of pressure by increasing the contact area of weave second one is straight camber or sloped camber this type of camber is provided by meeting two straight surfaces in the crown crown is the central and topmost point in the surface of the road here we can see in this diagram two straight line meeting at the crown the edge shape produces inconvenience to the traffic so it is not used in general third one is two straight line camber it consists of both straight lines steeper near edges and flatter near the crown it means the camber at the central portion consists of two straight line of similar slope and at edges two straight line of different slope fourth one is barrel camber it consists of continuous curve either parabolic or elliptical this type of camber is preferred for roads used by fast moving vehicles the equation for parabolic camber here is y equals to 2x square by n by w where w is width of carriage way x and y is the vertical and horizontal distance and n is the camber that is 1 in n where n will be the camber value 
our next topic is curve next cross sectional element is curve the meaning of curves is a barrier or boundary in highway engineering it indicates the boundary between pavement and shoulder or sometimes island or footpath or car parking space there are four types of curves first one is low or mountable curves second one is low speed barrier or urban parking curve third is high speed barrier curves and fourth is submerged curves now we will discuss about low or mountable curves or class one type curve its main function is to control traffic to stay within its own lane as the height of this type of curve is low it facilitates the driver to enter the area of shoulder with less difficulty beneficial for the longitudinal drainage system the height of this type of curve that is lower mountable curve is 70 to 80 mm now we will discuss about the second type of curve class 2 type curve or low speed barrier curve or urban parking curve it prevents encroachment of slow speed or parking vehicles to the footpath the height of this type of curve is 150 to 200 mm with a better of 25 mm to avoid the scraping of tires our our third type of curve is high speed barrier curves or class third type curve by mistake i have mentioned here two type but it is class three type curve it is usually used in critical places such as bridges or mountain roads this type of curves are 230 to 450 mm or more in height our fourth type of curve is submerged curves submerged curves are provided in rural roads and pavement edges between edge and shoulders it is provided in the form of standing bricks or concrete blocks it offers lateral stability to granular base course and flexible pavements what are the advantages of providing curb these are first one is this prevents the vehicle from parking beside the road second it acts as boundary between the pavement and footpath third curbs provided structural support for the pavement fourth it helps to overcome slipping risk of the vehicles fifth it helps to reduce the number of accident and sixth it also used for drainage purposes these were the some of the advantages if you find this video informative please do like subscribe and share with this your friends thank you so much for watching the video